Shannon Sam's here. Today I got a little bit of a sad story to tell. But before we get into that sad story, let's do something positive. Let's do something that everybody loves to see. Let's do it.
All right, guys, Mr. Camden here came to visit. I was gonna show him off my big bass. Surprisingly, one of my bears got eaten by something. That's a, one of the big, big bass that I have. Camden, you wanna help me? Okay, just hold, hold that thing, okay? He's full of eggs. Oh my goodness. Oh shoot. shoot. Go ahead and let, let her down. Oh my goodness. She's full of eggs too. Something mm. got in it and killed it. Mm. Now guys, this is a bigger than 10 pound bass right here. Okay, I can measure her, but I don't think at this point I wanna do anything. Mm. I wonder what happened, it looked like she's been stabbed or she's been attacked by something. She's full of eggs too, big fish. What do you think, Camden? She's gonna make it? She's not gonna make it, right? <laughs> I'm gonna find out, see what happened to my bass. Sorry, guys. Mm -hmm. You get to see this. All right, today we're not gonna do catch, clean and cook. <laughs> we, do, we do a water fountain. Yeah. We do water fountain uh, education 101. Since you're asking me about how to set up the water fountain. Right. Yeah, I know you started to buy some stuff, but, and a lot of guys out there, a lot of people out there is asking me, um, well, Sam, what size the pipe? What size the pump? I never did list it under the description. I never did. But uh, today I'm gonna show you. Okay. That's how long it's been sitting. <laughs> That's how long it's been sitting, got ants over. <laughs> Now guys, get the biggest one, biggest pump that you can get. Now this pump right here is 9,000 uh, 9, gallons per hour. Okay. okay. And I bought it from uh, eBay. And the, pay, the people that sell it is uh, Discount Aquatic. Okay. You wanna help me get this out? You know what? Yeah, let's, let's, let's get this out. Can you help me? Come on, Camden. <laughs> yes, yes, okay. A lot of ants, a lot of ants. Okay. Okay. Oh, righty. Look at this. Would you look at this? Oh, now that's only... This is the only thing that they give us to put them into the pump, okay? That's the only thing. That's the only thing they give us to the pump. The thing's three inches adapter. And here is the pump itself. Simple, very simple. Now what, what does the uh, water fountain do to your pond is, is give it uh, oxygen, okay. aeration, right? aerate it. Give your pond a, a lot of oxygen so your fish live better. Mm -hmm. And another thing is that they circulate the water. Okay, so you don't have a lot of algae in your pond. Also, pond dive. If you can dive your pond once every three or four months, that would be good too, or twice a year if you can, okay? All right, you see this? This is a 9,000 gallon per hour pump. This is the only thing to come with it. This is only going to come with it. Oh. That's it right there. This is what I bought from, I think, Greystone. Greystone water fountain head. It came with the styrofoam and with the hard cover on the top. It's the one that I use on uh, my big bass pond. And I, I kind of like it, but I think I, I spent like $152 for this. Okay. And I can make it cheaper. If you go back and watch the videos, and you're gonna see how I make it. 
I bought these from Lowe's and all those coupling that you do here, you can figure it out. But the main thing is you need, you need to taper it down. Okay, this is three inch pipe. You want to taper down to two inches like I did here. Okay, you, you taper it down. Okay. That way you keep like a jet, like a jet uh, pressure. Okay. Give it more high pressure so you can shoot higher, okay? Now, this right here is going to go on with the pipe that you can connect right here. Three inches pipe. Okay. Okay, you can find that adapter anywhere. Hardware store, you can get that. Now, this pipe right here is also, the length of it, it, it uh, determines how deep of the water you have in your pond. Okay. Me, myself, I like to use it probably 18 to 24 inches long pipe. I don't want to go any longer. But if you go any longer, you know, it's going to take a lot of pressure to push that thing all the way up. Right. And, and, and make it beautiful, make it higher. Jet. Our pond's about six to eight foot, depending on time. Okay, then, then you're good enough, then you go ahead and use uh, two feet, 24 inches okay. pipe cut. Now it's going to float. It's going to float. What I did here, on my other one, the one I purchased, I used too big of a pump because I like it bigger. Mm -hmm. Now that pump, kind of drag down the, uh, the foam, uh, sink it down in the water too much, okay? okay. It make it sink too much. With that um, foam that I have and this pipe here, I mean this pump here. That's why I invented this, this here. That's why I invent these guys right here. Now this here will keep the pump float. Okay. Uh, it will keep the pump float. That's all you need, guys. Nice. You come in with 30 foot, was it 30 feet of cord here, and then you can do extension. I mean, you know how to extension make the right. longer, reach to your house, reach to some neighbor's outlet. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds <laughs> good. <laughs> it goes to neighbor's outlet. That's the best thing. Camden, don't mind me, okay? <laughs> don't do that. That's illegal. Okay, this is um, now you can buy this. You don't have to make it. Okay. It's like 150 bucks, 152 dollars, free shipping. Not getting paid by these people, okay? I think Greystone carry it. You can look, it's a big round, 24 inches diameter here. And uh, I think it's N2 uh, model. Okay. That's all you need, guys. That will answer your question. If you have any more uh, questions, just go back and watch my videos. And uh, sometimes I miss something. But this here, just reinsure it, okay? What do you think? Want to have some healthy bass. Nice you know? lake. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Camden and his dad and mama, you know, <laughs> she, the mom ended up shooting a video for me. That's pretty good, right? <laughs> they they came here for the merchandise, for the shirts and the hat. They ended up, we ended up shooting the videos. <laughs> and the dad loved the water fountain. Yep. The boys loved the fish. Mm -hmm. And I love the company. And that's good. All right, guys. Good we'll see you guys. All right, guys. Now our guest is gone. I just couldn't believe that I lost my big mama, my big bass. I'm just curious about her weight and how big she is, so I went and take a measurement. She's 26 inches long and approximately 19 inches good, okay? Now, if you want to find out how, how heavy or how big they are, you take the length, time the girth, and time the girth again, and divide it by 800. I did that number of mines come out. She's, she, close to be a 12 pound bass okay I don't know how she died because a couple days earlier I went out and feed them and then I didn't see any dead fish out there but this morning taking our guests around children pond he liked the water fountain that's when we found out that uh, our, one of our bass is dead okay now the healthy bass they can live up to 18 years okay the healthy bass can live up to 18 years. I don't know what happened to mine. I probably never gonna know what happened to it. And I can assume that something got in it and killed it because she's fat. She got a lot of meat and full of eggs too. Okay. The only thing that I can think of is giving more protection, adding more uh, structure so they have a place to hide. There you go. That bear was full of eggs. She had not yet spawned. Something is killing it. 
I'm gonna find out, and I'm gonna find out. Maybe you have a gator in there. Mm, I'll find out if a gator in there. All right, guys, before I end this video, I wanna say thank yous to Little Cam and his parents for stopping by. Now, by the way, guys, Little Cam, Camden, also has his own YouTube video, which is uh, catching up with Cam, okay? Catching up with Cam, make sure you guys check that out. Show him some support. And other than that, thank you for watching. Smash that like button, and I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys.